that is Michael Jackson. Hello everyone and welcome to History Rewind, where we take a look at the weirdest moments and the most notable moments in music history. Today, in celebration of Michael Jackson's Thriller 40, we'll be taking a look at a weird moment that happened at Michael Jackson's Grammy acceptance speech. So, for those who do not know, this night was the night that Michael Jackson made history by winning a record 8 Grammy Awards. The only person I think who has ever come close to winning this many awards or this many awards is apparently Frank Sinatra, if I'm not mistaken. So a weird moment that happened during this speech is, well, let me let you guess. Watch this. Also, I'd like to thank all my brothers who I love very dearly, all of, including Jermaine. So did you notice it? Watch it again, one more time. This time, pay close attention to what Michael Jackson is saying. Very dearly, all of, including Jermaine. Very dearly, all of, including Jermaine. Very dearly, all of, including Jermaine. All my brothers, including Jermaine. Why did Michael Jackson feel the need to say this all the time when he was thanking his brothers? It's so weird. He said it at the end of his Victory Tour. He also said it in the Motown 25 special. Take a look. I have to say those were the good old days. I love those songs. Uh, those were magic moments with all my brothers, including Jermaine. Now there's a number of theories as to why Michael Jackson used to say I love all my brothers including Jermaine. Like what does that even mean? Does that mean like Jermaine is not one of his brothers? Like what was he alluding to when he was saying this? So the first theory is that number one Michael Jackson and Jermaine had secretly been feuding in the background and I think this is probably the most plausible theory as to why Michael Jackson always used to say I love all my brothers including Jermaine. I think Michael Jackson and him were feuding at the time and you know it was sort of kind of a sibling rivalry. Another reason and this is more much more sinister reason is that probably uh, Jermaine Jackson was envious of Michael Jackson's success and they used to have a lot of fights regarding uh, Michael Jackson's success and the fact that you know they would be nothing he would be nothing without the Jackson 5 and I think this is a much more darker theory but you know it's not out of the realm of possibilities especially knowing the family I mean it's not far-fetched that they would probably have an argument about this but anyway I just thought I would highlight this as it was really interesting why Michael Jackson would always say I love all my brothers including Jermaine isn't Jermaine one of your brothers but anyway if you enjoyed the first episode of history rewind why don't you please press the like button and if you want more Michael Jackson or more pop content press the subscribe button as we will take a look at the greatest music legends in history and we review them on on this channel so if you definitely don't want to miss out on cool original future content definitely press the subscribe button and don't forget the bell notification but anyway let me know what you guys think about this this was really weird I love all my brothers including Jermaine write it down in the comments below write your theories down in the comments below and let's engage let's talk to one another in the comment section below anyway I'll see you guys in the next video and hope you have a nice day